Well, one of the fallouts from the pandemic, unemployment and unemployment scams. An expert told our Tara Melita, as claims go down, scams go up. She has investigated these issues for more than a year now. And Tara, they're primarily phishing scams now. Erica, phishing scams, texts and emails, they're targeting a specific group of people. And the expert we talked to today say it's because they're paying out the most right now. These are the most recent phishing schemes we're told are targeting those who are unemployed now or were unemployed at some point during the pandemic. Emails and even a text contributing to the continued fraud problem. We talked to a partner at Personnel Planners, a third party vendor that helps clients process unemployment claims. Just last week, he says over 20% of their claims were fraudulent. Unemployment has been the easiest target right now. It's also the, the target that pays out the most at the moment. We've tracked phishing scams for months with another scam email just sent to our station's tip line. So what's the state doing about it? A spokesperson for IDES called these confirmation that bad actors are still working to defraud unemployment insurance systems nationwide, warning never to click on links sent in emails or texts. That state spokesperson didn't say specifically what they're doing at the state level to combat this kind of fraud, but did say they're warning legitimate claimants of these rising scams. Erica? Tara, we know people should be wary of these emails and texts. Is there anything else they should be keeping their eye out for? Well, with these scams continuing to increase, we're seeing new scams every single day. The expert we talked to said employers should be taking a role in this and be incredibly vigilant when those claims come into their offices. All right, Tara Molina, thank you.